A Supercuts stylist shows surprising calm and cool as a man robs her at gunpoint. We showed you the surveillance video earlier this week, but wait until you hear what the stylist said to him. Our Bonnie Campo tracked down that woman to get her side of the story. Bonnie? We know that robberies can happen anywhere, but a supercuts? Stylist Karen Soto says that it's a bit unusual, but she wasn't phased by this hardly at all. I greeted him like a regular person. I was like, hey, what can I do for you? Or what can I get for you? Just over two hours after the store opened, around 1130, this man walked in. Soto was the only employee inside. I think the only time my heart seriously raced race was the like the initial time I had the like I saw the gun and he kind of looked at it and he like shook it around and like showed me. She says she wasn't even supposed to be working Wednesday. She was filling in for a friend. But each moment that passed seemed to fly by. I didn't even like look at him in the face too much because I was like, you're not the last thing I want to see if you do kill me. Soto says she grew up near Juarez, Mexico, so guns and violence are nothing new to her. But this time, it's her story that might help police catch a criminal. He looked at the camera for like a split second and then he put his mask on and that's why I was thinking maybe he was a little bit nervous too. The man did get away with some cash but just as strange as this robbery started. Her final words to the man who held a gun just feet away, do you want a bag? And then the security camera captured this. I laugh whenever I'm nervous. I was like, have a good day I guess. And he was like, the cop like saw the video and he was like, do you really wish him a good day after he just robbed you? Now, police say that that man never pointed a gun at Soto. So far, there's no word on if he's been identified. Live on the scene on the story in West Oklahoma City, Bonnie Campo, News 9.